Portland, Oregon, a city that sits at the confluence of the Willamette River and the Columbia River. Portland is uniquely surrounded by trees and water. In fact, its original name was Stumptown because of the many trees they had to be cut down to allow for its growth. It is one of the most environmentally conscious cities because of its high walkability, large community of bicyclists, parks, farm-to-table dining, and expansive network of public transportation options. Portland is the largest city in Oregon, a state with unbelievable natural beauty, whether it's the rushing waters of the Multnomah Falls or the Bonneville Dam on the Columbia River or the rocky coastline. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride as we give you a tour of Portland, Oregon, city of natural beauty. Being that Portland is the number one bicycling friendly city in the U.S., we would do much of our tour on bike. It seems like no matter where you go, there is a bike path. Bicyclists are everywhere. So many great waterfront bike paths. right on one of the many historic bridges over the Willamette River. Portland was named after another city by the same name in Maine. It was almost named after another East Coast city, Boston, were it not for a coin flip. Portland was agreed upon after three flips of a coin, which was a fitting way to name a city that has become kind of a free and easy city. Well, that is, unless you are at a Antifa vs. Proud Boys rally and counter rallies. The city at times has become a hotbed of political passions. But whether you are on the side of Antifa or on the side of Proud Boys, you have to agree that Portland is beautiful. You can follow the path that Lewis and Clark took in 1805 down the Columbia River. Today, I-84 rides along this river for a stunning drive into Portland. Or take Route 14 on the Washington side for an even better view, less obstructed by trees. You can cross the river at Cascade Locks on Bridge of the Gods. Amazing power of rushing water at Bonneville Dam and Cascade Locks, just 48 miles west of Portland. Multnomah Falls is just 30 miles west of Portland. Portland is unique. Beginning in the 1960s, it became noted for its growing progressive political values, earning it a reputation of a bastion of counterculture. However, it does have some regressive laws like, you are not allowed to fill up your gas tank in the state of Oregon. A station attendant has to do it for you, a law that started in 1951. Another great way to see the city is on the Portland Aerial Tram in the South Waterfront District.
to give a shout out to REI Bike Shop and Camping Store in Tigard, Oregon, just south of Portland on Bridgeport Road. I just needed a couple of things tightened on my bike, walked in, and they did it in about a minute and for free. Check them out. They have a great selection of bikes. We are Tampa Aerial Media. We shoot travel promos across the USA. Check out our video of the Oregon coast being posted soon. Subscribe to our channel to see more. For licensing and stock footage, contact info at tampaaerialmedia.com. Thank you for watching Portland, City of Natural Beauty.